In this video, I want to talk to you about on Podio. Hi guys, this is Faye from Face World Media. Now, on Podio may not be all that foreign to some of you guys because its mission is to empower any fitness instructors to not only build their platforms but also build their own brands. I've been wanting to do this for over six months now. Today, I'm going to walk you through a lot of the key and core features for you to properly evaluate whether it's right for you or not. Before you think twice, OnPodio is completely free for fitness instructors. You may be wondering, well then, how do they make money? Well, they charge 49 cents plus 3% of the fees per transaction. So the platform is always free to you. The added cost will be paid by your customers. For example, for a class that costs $10, your customer or your students will be paying 79 cents out of that. So what is on Podio exactly? It's this all-in-one platform that allows fitness instructors to charge their classes, whether it is a single class or class pack or a monthly subscription with a coupon, special offers, automatically expiring the content that you upload. Speaking of which, yes, it actually allows you to upload your Zoom videos or your highly produced videos onto OnPodio as an on-demand content for your students to access at any time. You can also set an expiration date to drive urgency. What it's not for is that OnPodio is not a marketplace where you upload your own fitness classes among other hundreds if not thousands of fitness instructors so that customers will come to you. It is something that you maintain, you run and you market on your own. It is not a marketplace. With that said, well, let's take a look at some of the features. So the most important feature for OnPodio by far is the ability for you to set up virtual classes easily. You can connect your Zoom account so that as an instructor, you can create your class and within one click, your clients can just sign up for them. So I'm gonna show you exactly how to do that. Once you're under my class schedule, look to the lower right-hand corner, click on this big bright button and choose virtual group class. You can include your digital link. This can easily be your Zoom link or if you use other online virtual platforms will work just the same. Remember that digital link meeting ID and passcode will only be shared with clients via email after the reservation. So here I'm gonna say this is my link and my meeting ID is this and my passcode is 123123. Obviously you should use the correct one. And the class name is online virtual class. And I will select, let's say a single date, February 12th. The start time is gonna be 10 a.m. and it's gonna be 45 minutes. And this is not gonna be a recurring class and I have 10 spots available. I can also specify my playlist, any description, anything you want your students to know. You can make this class again, free, paid, or even a donation. Let me go ahead and just create this event. As soon as I've done that, now you can see a green class that's called online virtual class right here. Now I'm gonna show you how to book it. So here's how I go to the O'Malley Taekwondo landing page, just like that. Now under workout, let's take a look. See on Friday the 12th, now I have online virtual class. Now I'm gonna open up an incognito window so you can see what other people will see. Now I'm gonna click on reserve. And from here, look at that. I can quickly check I have read and agreed to the term of waiver and release and I can just go ahead and reserve my spot. Here, I have the option to continue as a guest without logging in, or I can create an account right here as well. So let's see what happens if I just say, hey, it's Faye and this is my email. Done, look how easy that is. As soon as I book my session, now I can see the name of the school, the class, class time, and my meeting ID and passcode are presented to me as well. And right here, before I forget the class, I can add it to my calendar. And I have the option to add to my Apple calendar, Google, Outlook, web app, and Yahoo. I'm going to click on Google. I just um, add it to my Google calendar. As you can see, it recognizes my time zone, online virtual class. Obviously, this can be more specific. And my attendee link is right here. If you want to schedule a paid class as a virtual class, it's just as easy. Same thing. And this is going to be a paid class and it'll be $10 per person, per class. And let me go ahead and create that. 
All right, check it out. So the paid class is here. What will happen if I refresh my workout landing page, go into the 13th, and there we go. It has a little wallet sign to show you it's paid. So click on that. And now I'm gonna say I have read this and reserved my spot just like that. Look how easy it is. It includes my total cost, my cart number, and this is powered by Stripe. And I can choose to save this cart to my account for future use. Pay now and you're all set. First, I wanna quickly show you how you can easily edit the instructor's profile. So using myself as an example, I'm using an actual martial arts school, which I've been going to for over a decade called O'Malley Taekwondo Center in Peabody, Massachusetts. Um, but here I'm gonna show you uh, directly within creator profile. Creator, by the way, that's you, you are the instructor. And I'm gonna go into settings under creator portal. That's how I get to the general information. So from here, I just need to upload a landscape oriented photo or image for my website. So I'm gonna select this photo right here. You can resize it slightly, click on save. Profile is updated. So, so for you to see what it looks like, simply go uh, and open up another window. So as you can see, uh, you can obviously change your school name and it says Taekwondo for children and adults. Here you can type in location as well. It's gonna load Peabody, Massachusetts. You can, you can change your tagline. Let's see what happens if I do MJ O'Malley Taekwondo. So if I save that, I'll refresh this page here. So right here, um, MJ O'Malley Taekwondo in Peabody, Massachusetts. You can choose the classes and you can update the contact information, website, and you can connect all your social media links here, including Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, and Twitter. In addition to your fitness classes, you can add other services. These are the common ones, personal training, strength coach, wellness coach, etc. So as mentioned before, if you do not have a website yet, you don't have the budget or the time or the resources to create one, you can easily use on Podio's landing page right now. They're going to have uh, more templates coming soon, but to get started, this is not bad. And you have the option to list your workouts as well as your packages here, and you can include more about information on this last tab. So to start, I'm going to create a class schedule. I'm gonna make this up. So you have the four options here. You can block off time when you're not teaching, the school is not open, to a new private session, one-on-one, -on -one, or a new studio group class. And last but not least, nobody's new to this virtual group class. So I'm gonna create a group class right here, and I can select the location, class name, I would say beginner's class, and I can send the date to be the 29th, which is a Friday, and it is 45 minutes. And here I can say this is recurring, make this a recurring class for four weeks, but you can certainly change into many more weeks, for example, for the entire year. And if you have a booking link, make sure you include that. You can also include music playlist, but you can keep it as simple as this and just click on create. Right here, you have the class first starting on the 29th. If I simply click on next, you will see that this will appear for four weeks, just like that. And now underneath my workout page, check it out. I refresh that and there you go. As simple as that, my four classes can be reserved and it's available right here. So in order to add a class pack or a subscription, you need to go to packages on the left-hand side, click on the plus sign in the lower right-hand corner. Here you have the option to choose to create class packs. That could be a single class or multiple classes. I'm gonna show you both. And also within this option, you can create monthly memberships. So I'm gonna create first a single class pack. That's $10 for only one class with no expiration. You are required to create class pack description so you create greater clarity for what it can be used for. So here I say that the class credits can also be used for live classes, on-demand classes, and I'm gonna click on create and add. The reason why I'm unable to do this is because my Stripe account is not connected. In order to create a class pack, you need to connect your Stripe account. So I'm gonna do that. And it's the same place where I can also integrate Zoom video conferencing as well. Now, after I connected Stripe, I come back to packages right here and click on the plus sign. And here I wanna say new class pack. 
Now, I encourage most fitness instructors to think about multiple class pack as opposed to single ones, but I do understand that sometimes you do have to offer them. So here I create a single class of just $10, one class, no expiration. And here you're required to enter class pack description by one class for $10 and click on create an ad. That's it. Now I can also create multiple class packs. So for example, uh, four times pack, and this is, I'm going to give a slight discount, let's say $30. The number of classes is four with no expiration. So buy four classes for only $30. And for people who can't do the math, you can even indicate how much that's going to be. Create an ad. So four pack. And I'll show you how to create a new membership here too. So this is, I'm going to call it monthly membership. And the cost will be $120 per you can choose between week and month. So I'm going to choose month and I will say unlimited class access. And here I might even offer a free trial of three days. How about that? Create an ad. Now you have memberships as well as class packs. Let's take a look at the landing page right now. If I refresh this page now under packages, you, you have all these options and it's really helpful to kind of see them stacked up side by side. And um, you can also see that this one comes with a free trial. So if I'm an end user, what will I see? I click on that, agree to the payment of service. I start my free trial right here. And in order to complete the transaction, I need to enter my card information. As I mentioned earlier in this video, this includes a $3.60 for the fee for the entire month. So I'm going to close this out. Same thing with single class. I can click on sign up. And same thing, I can buy a single class I will use for just one class. Let's take a look at coupons on the left-hand side. Right now, there's no coupon, but to add one is really simple. Click on the plus sign again. And here, let's just say that this is a New Year promo, 20% off. And this is a percentage off as opposed to the whole thing off. And let's just say 20% off. And discount code will be 20 off. You can choose whatever it may be. You don't have to use what's already in the placeholder and limit to ones per customer. Um, you also don't have to limit the usage. So a customer can use it as many times as possible. Click create coupon. By the way, before we move forward, you're welcome to also limit uh, where this coupon can be used. As you can see from what I can tell right now, you can't really use for the general monthly membership I just created. But let's see, let's create the coupon. So it's right there. And this is the code 20 off. So I'm going to go back to this landing page, refresh. So as you can see, I'm unable to use the coupon for the monthly memberships or just memberships in general, but I can use it for class packs. So I just pick the four pack and right here there is apply coupon and I'm going to enter 20 off and hit apply. So now the total cost went from $30 to $25 and 21 cents. Under transactions, you're able to see all the transactions and purchases I've made in the past and under clients, I'm able to see myself as a test, but all your clients saved right here. You can email all of them. So if you click on that, it pops open your Gmail or you can export them as well. So you'll get an Excel sheet with all your client information. Lastly, I want to talk about on demand right here on the left hand side. And you can create collections right now. It says, Hey, you got nothing here. So if I click on collection, so I can create my first collection videos for beginners. I can create another collection videos for advanced. And currently there are no videos saved in any of these collections. So I'm going to go ahead and select that videos for beginners. And from here I can. I can make this collection visible or invisible. So I'm going to make it visible so we can see on the landing page. And here, lower right hand corner, I can upload the video so I can give it a class name. I can choose the collection where it belongs and I can upload the raw video or I can click on upload URL. Here you can add a URL to Zoom or to YouTube. YouTube is always my default when it comes to uploading videos. I just find that YouTube's video optimization is a lot easier to use. 
And you can also upload what I consider a thumbnail. So you can, by default, use my profile image, but you can upload something more relevant and compelling. You can give it a description and you can give it a price too. So right now I am going to just make something up and this is test by Fay beginners. And I'm just going to upload any YouTube video I got here. Why not? I'm going to use my latest video. Just grab the URL and drop it right into here. And uh, description, blah. And I'm going to say this is $10 add class. So because I selected upload an image, now the image is required. But if I change back to the profile image, I am done. Thanks so much for watching this video. I just want to say that you guys, my fitness instructors, are the core of my audience and you helped me start and sustain this very channel. And I want to thank you so much for being here. I cannot wait to see you in the future video. By the way, you may be wondering, what is 2021 about for Phase World Media? I want to show you the holistic approach to running your platform and your business. So I want to show you behind the scenes what you need to know about website design, email marketing, in addition to Zoom, Livestream, and beyond. If you haven't subscribed, hit the bell button, and so you know how to get notified next time when I go live or when I produce a new video.